in this video, I'm going to share with you one of my favorite passing concepts from the Trips Tight End Offset in Madden 21. Learn some passing plays for one of the better running formations in the game. Now, if you're new to the channel and you don't know my name, my name is Cody. It's so nice to meet you guys. And if you have not subscribed yet, my channel is all about becoming a better Madden player in Madden 21. And so if you're looking to get better at this game, I want to encourage you to go ahead and click that subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. It's completely free to subscribe. And if you want YouTube to let you know whenever we release new videos, go ahead and click that little bell icon in there. That way you can turn on your notifications and that way YouTube will let you know whenever we release a new video. All right, guys, so the play we're going to be going over today is PA Crossers. This is one of the best plays in the game, and uh, it's really, really simple to run it, but it's a very nice little play that you can run in combination with your RPO Trap Alert Bubble. Now, if you haven't been on the channel for a while, you might know that about my text message membership, but what my text message membership is, is it is a way that you can get my free schemes every single week so every single week i sit down for about an hour and i break down a free 100 free complete offensive or complete defensive scheme in this game and so this last week we broke down the trips tight end offset so if you want to get this full scheme it's actually a whole playlist we update the playlist every week with a new video or a new a new scheme breakdown so in the past we've broken down things like the u trips the trips tight end the trips tight end offset the big nickel over g the nickel 335 wide the bunch tight end the gun bunch and i could go on and on so if you want to get those schemes sent to you via text message every single week all you have to do is text me my cell phone number is 208 218-6900 and whenever you text me if you could do me a favor and send me the first text that you sent me if you could just send the word madden that will automatically send you the video so that you can get that as soon as possible you get access to all 15 i think we're at 16 videos now in that playlist but anyways if you know anything about the trips titan and offset you might have seen it in the draft mutt drafts uh, Mutt Drafts gameplay. This is a phenomenal, phenomenal offensive scheme because of the simpl simplicity that it provides you. It's probably, it, it might be better than the trip side in because of how good these runs are. As you can see here, I'm just dominating with the run. But the passing from this is actually really, really good as well. So how do you set up to play P8 crossers? Actually relatively easily. All you're going to do is you are going to go ahead and you are going to simply um, put your running back on an option route. You're going to streak your tight end, which is Robert Tunyon here, the X receiver. So the R1 receiver is the running back. We're gonna put him on an option route. We're gonna streak the tight end, which is the X receiver. We're gonna put that triangle receiver on a slant route, okay? And then we're going to take the square receiver on the left side here, and you can do anything you want. You can smart route him, or you can put him on a whip route or his out route, okay? Either way is going to be effective. And we're just gonna motion that triangle receiver from left to right, and what you're gonna see here is you have an absolutely amazing, amazing passing concept. Now, uh, against cover three, you can actually sometimes fit that in. The one thing I've gotta do a better job of is I've got to let that slant get a little bit better spacing if I want to throw that route. So I'm going to show you that one more time here. And literally, again, set up with we're going to streak the tight end, put the, R, the R1 receiver on an option route, the triangle receiver on a slant, and the square receiver on an out route. Or if you want to leave them on the post route, just make sure you smart route it. So I'm going to let Adams get a little bit more space here. And what you're going to see is now I can get that ball really quickly up the skinny, right up the middle, right up the seam against cover three. It's actually a really, really good, uh, really, really, really good concept that you can hit against the cover three defense. Now, what about the... What about the crossing route? The crossing route is actually super effective as well. Um, these are 25 yard curl flats. I just want you to watch what happens. Streak's gonna open up some space. That R1 route's gonna open up some space. Uh, and then you can basically playmaker it against that. Now, this will not get open against 25 yard zones, but it will get open against you know if they're if they're if they're on default right for example or if they're on you know running some underneath coverages or things like that you're going to see that this circle route is a very very powerful route in this year's game um it's probably probably at least a top five route if not the number one route in madden 21 as you see right there gets open against a lot of different coverages now the beauty of this is let's say that for example maybe they're running some man-to-man -man coverage on you that's where the option route to the running back comes into play and this little motion slant route these little quick reads right here are super super effective against the man-to-man -man coverage you're going to see that that triangle receiver on that motion slant is literally almost always going to be wide open 
against man-to-man -man coverage, especially with the lack of one step ahead that you are seeing at the highest level right now due to the AP changes that they just instituted. It's very actually relatively easy, honestly, to beat man-to-man -man coverage because you can do a lot of things like that. You can also, if you want to leave that skinny post out there, that skinny post is a really nice read. As long as you smart route it, it does a really, really good job against man-to-man uh, -man coverage. It also does a really good job against cover two, uh, which we'll show you that here in just a moment. But you'll see here again that motion slant, smart route that post route, and you're going to see that this crosshair is really going to pull a lot of zones. A lot of the times the user will go with that. As you can see there, that post route comes right over the middle of the field against that Tampa 2 wide open absolute laser. Now you might be saying, well, what about cover four? Um, this actually does a decent job at beating cover four. The one problem with it is if you know it's cover four, you want to put your tight end on like a delay fade or something. You wouldn't want him on a streak because he's going to kind of get in the way of everything. But you'll see here again, these slants, these slants are super, super good. The the, sl the motion slant is probably, it's again, it's one of those, it's probably, it's gotta at least be a top five route in this year's game. But the one thing I will tell you about the motion slants is let's say that they're playing their Mabel coverage at five yards. So they've got the underneath zone set to about five yards. As long as you have that out route on that left side here, what you're gonna see is if there's no yellow zone on that side of the field, you can hit that little motion slant relatively easily against pretty much every zone coverage in the game. Now, if you wanna get the full trips tight end offset scheme, learn how to run these bubble screens, learn how to run all these things that are really, really glitchy out of this formation, I want to encourage you to go ahead and text me. My cell phone number is 208-218-6900. It'll also be in the top left-hand corner as well as the description of this video. But all you have to do is text the word MADDEN to 208-218-6900 and I will shoot you an automatic text message. That way you can get that video. And then if you have any questions, you can also hit me up there. That's the best way to get in contact with me. So if you want to get the full scheme, text the word MADDEN to 208-218-6900. And if you have a question, just go ahead and shoot me a text with your question as well. Thank you so much for your time. I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you on stream tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time.